Hello and welcome back to my channel. It's me again. Um, I'm back today doing a bag opening from Prime Thrift. This bag was just there. There was only one. They don't have them that much when I go in. So I grabbed it. It was nineteen nineteen, and I believe I had a coupon for either five dollars off. I think my whole purchase that day. I think I ordered about other stuff too though. Um, so we're gonna dig into this. See what's in her. Don't expect too much in these. I don't really find silver in them that much. So we'll see. I do see some like food jewelry in here on the card. Let's see what we got. I never know. Alright, we have this kind of cord slide necklace with this bead on there. I think it's a ceramic bead or something or clay. It's a design. Like that. We have a little, little bent up bangle. Clink. We have a clouds with a tag on it. Let's see. Is I guess a I don't know if it's a necklace or a bracelet. Does it say? It doesn't say, but it is from Claire's. It's got the price tag. It's got the rhinestone crossed, the studded leathery pleather. I don't know. This one's kind of got issues on the back there, so not so new as it would seem. Wear from being old. Uh, so there's that. Here we have a little bracelet. Silver tone. Very, very soft. What does it say? It says pure, pura vida. Silver tone-ish. Got a little stone there. I don't know. That's a stone. I think it's some kind of stone. I don't know it's how light or what it is. Um, so, move on to the next thing. Another kind of cordy necklace. That slides, I guess. Yeah. With some beads. And it's like we have some lapis stones on there. It'd be nice if they were silver beads with it or something, but they're not. It's okay. Then we have a I Love My Daughter. Oh, I'll wear that one right now. Stretchy. I love my daughter. Okay, another stretchy. We're not going to wear this one. Gunning, Bed Gunning Bedford Panthers. Never heard of it. Don't know. Here we have a eyeglass cord with some little seed beads and some other little plasticky beads. Red. Be good for Christmas time. Okay. We have oh, some blank cords that aren't used. I guess these are new to make necklaces. Got a couple, quite a few of them there. Oh, we have another one of these. The painted bead. Slide necklace. Cute little seam on it. The hub here. A bracelet. Some silver. Leather. Um, these beads have some wear on them, so that's not that best. Wear there, wear there. Lobster call class. This one's not signed. Little plastic stretchy. A little drop thing on it. Oh, here's a cute little little faux pearl bracelet. Little lobster claw class. 
little rondelle going there. Cute. Ooh, a ring. There's an adjustable ring. Some purple stone. I don't even see any plastic, to tell you the truth. <laughs> and a teardrop shaped setting. This one's pretty, pretty not good. Well, it's very sharp and that metal is so thin. Kind of looks like a bubble gum ring. Mm -hmm. oh, that. I don't want to break it, but it's pretty. Okay, let's see. Yeah. A pair of earrings new on the card. If I can get this other thing off of it. Yes, yes, yes. So since these are like druzy earrings. You can't really see that they got like the white druzy in there. I think it's fake druzy. These are from somewhere, don't you know? But they were seven ninety five. Then little cross necklace, little spring ring. This is probably vintage. -y. A bow tone cross. Let's see if there's anything on the side. Nope. Chain, spring ring clasp. The feeling I wanted to come out. Anyway, I don't know if I remember to said it, but I have a Etsy shop called Jen's Vintage Jen's, and it has two ends for Jen. Um, so go check that out if you'd like. Here's a cute little earring, faux pearl, rhinestones. Oh, the other one's in there. Oh, we have a tangle. Tingle, tangle. Mm -mm. Alright, so, well, I'll get this untangled later, so we don't take up too much time. But here is, like, a black enamel chain, I guess it is, or gunmetal color chain. Just some little danglies, little faux pearls. Okay, and that has a little spring ring class. And we have this, I guess it's a bangle. Kind of got the cuts in it. Then we have this new on-card necklace here. Looks like it's got a little curved bar feature in the front with some little black square faceted pieces to go in there and a little thin gold tone chain with a lobster claw clasp and this one was $9.95 new I have one earring on the card I'll put this to the side in case we find another here I have so pretty it's a cross got the little etched pieces inside. I like that. Not sure. This is wood underneath. Plastic. Kind of sounds like wood underneath and it's painted blue. Not sure. We have that. box or something. We'll save that for a minute. There's another little box in the bottom too. Unhook these things. Oh! Oh! See something? Oh, I like. Okay, so then I have this. And again, I don't know, these are just yuck to me if they're not, like, brand new. If someone used them already. Little studded leather choker or wrap bracelet, whatever. This is cool. I like these little glass pieces. Alright, let me see if I can get it untangled. I'm assuming it's a necklace. Oh. Come on. 
camera off. somewhere. Don't know where. Alright. Better. What about this? I guess you get the gist, right? I don't need to undo the whole thing. Here we have like a multi-layer necklace with these cool, just very crude shaped glass beads. They have a little bubbling in it, some of them, just very pretty, seed beads, and just this clasp, but I kind of like those, those are really cool, oh, we have a symbol, and it says, I don't know what it says, Maggie Valley, North Carolina, anybody collects thimbles? Need one from Maggie Valley? I'm your girl. I have it. Okay, I see another cheese mill ring. Hmm. Alright, I don't know what this is. Exactly what it's supposed to be. First, I thought it was a Christmas tree ring. But it's just like another ring. It's made like the other adjustable ring. It's not really, you know, the nicest metal or anything like that. Little ring. Got some little rhinestones on there for accent. Gold tone. Makes this kind of not great adjustable back. Another gross one of these. This one is really disgusting. They pop their rhinestones off of it though and save those. Alright. Please be sterling. Definitely is, and I'm definitely keeping that one. Alright, hold on. I'll show you this one first. Here's a little seed bead, and what's this? Stone chip bracelet with a barrel clasp. Cute. Look at this one. This one, I already see the charm on it, which is what I'm keeping. It's signed 925 Mexico. And has a nice little plan on it. So then it has a corded thing, and I will be taking that off and finding a chain for that. So is it Mexico 925A A H or A B C? I don't know. But that's cool. Oh, actually, I found silver in the bag. Like this, I wish I'm gonna alright. Alright, this one says the leather bracelet, the good shepherd, the lion of Judah, the Messiah, the Lord, uh, Lord Counselor, the Son of God, King of Kings. Cool, but it's kind of like you know, not so great. Someone has someone's sweat on it. We have this one, not so great, scratched up bangle, plastic. Another one of these, not so great bangles. Oh, I hope the other one's in there. What? I have a little sterling silver heart earring, apparently. With a little red stone in it. This is Samara. Oh, so cute. I hope I find the other one. Alright. Oh, there's another one of these rings. Here's a silver tone fashion ring. Adjustable. Again, another teardrop purple stone, and this one's got some other kind of rhinestone accent over top. I mean, they're fun just to wear for fun. Get into that box, too. I'll save the boxes for last, I guess. Whoa. But I had no idea this is all one piece thing. See? Get a pocket tangled in there. So, this. Don't know what someone's thinking here. But, you ready for this one? Look at this thing. Got something going on. Not quite sure. 
What do you think? That's kind of cool part. I don't get why they have this part on there. So it's double stranded, kind of. It's got a lobster claw clasp. It doesn't have a tag or anything. But that's a first for me. This one kind of like it way better on the camera than it does look in real life. This, this part's kind of cool. That cabin little locket, another little, I believe, are these shells, a little shell and faux pearl. No, it's not faux pearl, sea bead bracelet, and then we have a little locket attached to that circle locket, no pictures inside. Those two things. Not so bad. We have another necklace on the cord. Some beads. And that's probably a polymer bead. And this choker. Don't know. Someone's got some thread and some faux suede. Lobster claw clasp. Not exciting for me. What else? United States of America. Don't sound like much in there. I'm going to save that to the end, too. See what's in that. Oh, it doesn't fit in. Oh. These are really pretty shells. Is this a bracelet? Look at these really pretty purple and pink shells. Love the colors of those. That. And these are coming up better in my hand than they are on the camera. Oh, I love them. Pieces. Alright, they are really stretched out though. Big little thing. In. The truck is back. Oh. All right. Not sure what this is. Definitely not sterling. We have this big cuffy bracelet. I believe. What is this? I can't. I believe these are just drops of enamel on top of there. I don't believe they're real stones. And a piece of this one is missing, unfortunately, too. Sadly. The other half. It would be good to wear for fun, but it's very not great metal. But that. The centerpiece would be fun to use as something in the craft, though. Right, another, ooh, here's another ring, another fashiony ring. You ready for this one? Not quite sure what it is. That's a pretty blue rhinestone. Oh, it just empties out a lot of the bag. Look at these. Too bad they're so worn and all. But, someone's got these stretchy big beads, and then they got this hair clip. Oh no. This hair clip broke. What is this? This is actually a hair clip brooch. So it can be either, but kind of gross. It's been in that bag. I don't know where it's been. What do we have here? I got excited. I thought these were going to be some kind of good beads, but they're not. We have these little plasticky beads on some kind of fishing string with some kind of chain here attached and a lobster claw clasp. Um, no, I don't get that. Don't like it. 
little stretchy, just a little gold metal, kind of half a circle shaped beads. I have this much left in the bag. Oh, drop something. Here I have a Mac -a dog tie pin. Like Mac tools. Back is missing. Oh, lucky me, I got two of these. I'm gonna be my twin. There we have oh, this is nice. Like this. Maybe not the charm, but I like the bracelet. Glass faceted. Glass. And then these have a slight facet too. And I'm not sure if those are stone or glass, the cloudy looking ones. That's cute. And it says it's got a crown on it, which that part don't bother me. It says the girl. The girl. Who's the girl? Oh, we have a little cross pin. I'll check that. I doubt it's anything, but I'll check it later. We got a chunky, these are plasticky beads on a rope necklace. Someone's home. I can mute. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. My daughter came in. Sorry, the dogs are barking. And still barking. So, now I'm just gonna have to talk louder. Next. Oh, this is cute. I have this lion tie pin. He's actually cute. Oh, I like his features. Just check on that. Uh, it says something on the back. I guess it's going to be Swank, but I don't know. I can't really see, but I will look at that later. But he's got a lot of cool features, like, for being so little. He's got nice features. I like him. Alright, I just got other earrings in the bag. We got this necklace here. See what's going on. That one. Right in the way you can see it. Exactly. Don't let me forget to open those. Okay, so there's that. And this one does have a tag. And this one says INC. INC. Like that. This stretched out stretch bracelet. Be nice if we could put it back together. Some more chunky plastic beads. Here we got a Leo. Looks like part of a um, keychain holder or something. Alright, then we got another fashion earring. This one's kind of got like, you know, an amber colored plastic stone in there. And those are not the best. I think we all get one of these in every color. Kind of like this color though. Shell bracelet. A cute little fashion ring. No, that's not bad. Oh, they're pink. I don't know why you can't see that. They're light pink around the edges and then a dark pink one in the center. But it's totally not showing on this camera. Cute. <coughs> and adjustable. Alright. What is this? A just a chunky pendant. Hammered round disc with a rhinestone. 
wire pin. Why is that Taiwan? Taiwan. Mark Taiwan. Just a gold tone little bracelet. With a lost your salt glass. Oh, looky here. Look what's in my thing. Got a fidget spinner. The basketballs. Not jewelry. Get it together. Bull. Have this one seen better days nope I don't like it this is not quite sure Leo like another Leo charm or something to a keychain oh. so here's another like pin is missing off of it. Looks like it's a brooch. With a an artesian one like someone made it and put the painting on it. The pin back is missing. I hope they get a new one and glue it on there. A little USA safety pin pin. Like the flag. Almost done here. We got a what is this? Star bar, bar, you know, a tie pin or something. Weird looking. Looks like a baton. Okay, name. Got stars on the end. Like that. We have a hoop de doop. What's a hoop to? Put the earrings here. I got some little hoopy earrings. I think is this a pair? I believe this is a pair. We got ya. Okay. These look like someone made these or something. These are little musical note necklaces with little stone musical notes. That adventurine, some kind of jasper, and I don't know what the white one is, some kind of marble or something, or alite or something. Those are all on cords. Cute charms, though. I don't like the cords. Or these little ceramic bead um, necklaces, slide necklaces. Almost done. Oh, then I gotta remember to do the box. Oh, this is a cute little one. Little locket pin, though. New on the card. Curiosity to see if anybody put a picture in it. Nope. No picture, but very cute. Still on the little card. Oh, here's the other little one of those earrings. So I got the pair of those, which those are kind of cute. Up another musical note necklace. That makes four. Got here. A glass. Oh, this is alright, I guess. It's different. Got a little bow sleeve thing. I think these bottom ones are glass. These ones are just plastic. Not sure though. Mm -hmm. And little plastic. Rose necklace with a barrel clasp. We have oh, let's see what the oh oh. Thing says sterling all over it. Forged, it says forged, but it says sterling here, and it's marked sterling here at the bottom corner of this front piece too. But that's all sterling. That's the heavy little piece there. Forged. Nice. Sterling. I got sterling. I wish I had that other earring in the bottom. Oh, it is. I see the little heart earring. So I do have the other little heart earring. Sterling one. Where put it? I got 
see the earrings too. Sterling. But I did find no sterlings. What else I got in here? I only got a little pack pins and stuff left. I'll dump it out the bottom. Be done with that. Alright. So I do have this pair of little earrings. They're cute. They're little gold tone. They're little curved like triangles with some enameling. Actually kind of cute. Lightweight. Put it to the side. Angel pin. Got a little pin rhinestone, I believe. Green rhinestone. A Achiever Award. J A. I don't know if that means it's the Achiever Award. Just look at the back. So it says some kind of mark, but I don't know what. Those two. Got a blingy blingy. What is this guy? Oh, it's got some letters. I don't know what that is, but it's a cute little blingy heart. Okay. And a bowling pin arm. Sorry, my son's over school now. We're almost done, and I'm going to get off here real quick. Do have the other little earring off of this card. On the back, I guess this is it. And, so sorry. Right, I'll be back in a minute. Uh, so I made a little seed bead ring with a little cross. And a flag pin. <laughs> Shush! Then we have. Oh, what is this? Aries, maybe? Yeah, I think it's a little Aries pin. Um, tie pin. It says Aries on it. Let's see what this one's marked. And on the back, it's kind of got like little symbols. It's hard to. I, you can't even see it. It's got like all little horoscope symbols around the back with a sun. Look at the airy symbol. Alright, then we have. I know I showed you that one, and then. Is that a different one? So two Junior Achievement Awards, and then I have a 100% Perfect Attendance Award. And that's all that's in. Oh, no, 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 no! You almost forgot. You almost let me forget. We have these two boxes, then we'll be done. Again, I apologize about my dogs. I did try to hear, let me find my headphones, I couldn't find it. Okay, this, oh, somebody's other metal's missing out of here. Please, look like somebody's metal award. But it looks like there's something missing from here. What do you suppose will be there? I know I have to look that up. There is a little pin here. But there's something missing up here. Anyway, that's what's in that box. So that's kind of cool. And then last but not least. Oh, just a little heart necklace. Gold tone. I'm not going to take it out now. I doubt it's silver or nothing. It says latest fashion, so I highly doubt it. But it's a little puffy heart. Gold tone on a gold tone necklace. And that's it. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you liked out of the bag. Do something. Go check out my Etsy. Uh, come back and see me next time. Bye.